Hey guys, my name is Chip, and welcome to Chrono Cross. Because last week we've actually finished Chrono Trigger, we're actually now going on to the sequel. This game was released back on the PlayStation. Um, I remember this game fairly fond, very fondly. Um, and uh, we're gonna keep going. So uh, here we go. Start our new game. We're gonna go ahead and keep the vibration on. This kind of goes over. Well, it goes over all, everything here. So talk confirm. Run cancel. All that jazz. So now this is our protagonist search. I'm not gonna change names again because I like having the default name. Ooh, movie time. What's really cool about the, the beginning of this game is every time you start a new game, you actually have a different third party member. Like it's just a random party member that they add. So you get to see some pretty cool characters, even though you're just starting the game. So with me, I have I have Razly as my third character. Then I have Kid, and then obviously Serge. What is it, Sergi? You look troubled. This is it. There's no turning back now. Oi! Come on, Serge. Razly. I'm gonna do a terrible, terrible accent. Just you, White Links. Today is going to be the day of reckoning. Say your prayers. Not, not all do you any good. <laughs> Sergi! Okay, so real quick, just gotta do some customization here. Uh, because I want to run all the time, so I'm gonna go here. And we're gonna make sure that the B button is when that we walk. We can change the the, uh, the different uh, frames. I'm gonna, actually gonna go back to this frame for now. What's really cool is in this game you can actually get different uh, different frames. So it's kind of a neat little thing here. Um, also, with that video that I played just before the, we started the video, I hope you guys enjoyed it. Um, it was something that I wanted to add. 
uh, to kind of give uh, some uh, some closure to the, the Chrono Trigger uh, game and then transition transition us into Chrono Cross. Okay, so now that we have got all of our settings selected here, we're going to go ahead and take a look here. This is where we need to go. What's that crystal like thing? Some kind of switch. Bugger! So close yet so far. So this game, like Chrono Trigger, it has multiple endings. Um, this game really wants you to play multiple times. So it's definitely a heavily emphasis on the new game plus. Um, I don't want to fight you. Which I find really cool. I mean, because then you can get all the characters. There's, um, there's just a fight there. Oh, there, there's nothing down here. <laughs> but, um, yeah, no, I really enjoy uh, games like this, so, which has multiple endings or, you know, heavy emphasis on a new game plus, which then forces me to, you know, play the game again and see where I need to go. But first off, we got to go in here. We gotta go turn on the lift. Oh. Okay. Go ahead and run back here. Oop, back there for a moment. Oh, we might actually have to fight. Nope, we don't. So here is the elevator, teleporter. Oh, boy, what the bloody hell just happened? What are we doing out here? Wow, bugger! We're so high up! Is this thing floating? Did it feel like your body passed through the floor just now? This is so sure some fort. Hey, Serge. You're right, mate. You've been acting all weird. We don't know what's ahead, so just stay on your toes, eh? Mm hmm. Here we go. Uh oh. Oh. Oh, blood. Spiling surge. Or is it? Surge. Good morning, surge. Come on, sleepyhead, get up! Oh, sounds familiar. Chrono? Mom? Chrono's mom? Surge took out Surge's not so secret savings. So we got 200 gold. With the rest? Nah, not now. 
if there's anything else in here. I mean, I can close the, sh the shades. Yep. Okay. So now we'll go ahead and move around. Good morning, Serge. We're finally up. The sun's already high noon. By the way, didn't you have plans to meet with Lena this morning? Lena came by to see if you were up, but you were but you, young man, were still off in Neverland. You shouldn't break that promise like promises like that. Girls can be pretty scary if you make them angry. Ain't that the truth? So there's multiple cats. As you can see, as in like the previous game, Chrono just had his mom and cat. Where Chrono, I mean, in this case, Serge's mom has two cats. Serge, check out this sawfish. That is a big ass fish. <laughs> awesome, ain't it? Poppy caught it down south by the El Nido Triangle. Nobody likes going down there, though. They're all creepy. They all say it's creepy. This sucker sure looks tasty. Mmm. Yum. Yo, Serge, what do you think of this sawfish? Have you ever seen one this size? Ha! This has got to be one from the legendary Dragon King Palace. Wouldn't you agree, Serge? Yeah, you're probably right. You think so, too? I knew it. I just knew it. It really is true. And from here on out, happiness will be rolling into my life. Business will pick up. Money will start pouring in. I'll be able to repair my roof, garnish my boat, buy a new sail, eat as much squid, uh, squid gut pasta as I want in Termina. Termina. Ah, life is good. Yeah, right. Who am I kidding? That would be definitely too good to be true. Thanks anyway, Serge. <laughs> Thanks for playing along. Here's a little something for you. Give it to a girl you like. Sister sees Komodo scale without lifting a finger. I wish the legend was true, though. The Dragon King Palace. There are enough dreams out there lately. Ha! Okie dokie. Hello, oh, Serge. Beautiful day, isn't it? Sure feels great outside. Ah, just being able to bask in the sun all day is a nice change. They say that rain cleanses one's spirit. At our age, we've had enough cleansing. Heh. <laughs> dirty old lady. Yes, I know. I wonder if these outsiders uh, are back digging up, back digging now the rain is allowed up. Can't read today. <laughs> They must be conducting some kind of investigation up there in Fossil Valley. I can't comprehend outsiders. Why would they want to dig up a palace like that? A place like that? Place palace. Wow. I just cannot read today. <laughs> Yo, Sergi. I heard you totally blew off Lena this morning. Didn't think you had it in you. That was really gutsy of you. I guess that kind of shows who, who who's boss, hey? Huh? Don't tell her I said that. <laughs> Don't tell her I said so. But my sister's a bit too quick to lash out. Could you, could you like, make her a little nicer than me? You have my support all the way. I'll keep my fingers crossed for you. Hey, Sergi. Do you know what's popular around the village these days? A necklace made from Komodo dragon scales. You know, these monsters that eat fire? I want to get some for Kiki. There's no way I can beat those monsters. Oh no! If I don't do anything about this now, Kiki might start liking Lolo. Boy, I am. Am I in a fix? Kiki Lolo. <laughs> this is the restaurant here. I talk to this barrel. Like hello, barrel. No answer. It's just a barrel. No answer, it's just a barrel. What do you want already? I said I'm just a barrel. Okay, got an uplift. Oh, I found a Hecran bone. Wait, a Hecran? 
Ivory helmet. Go ahead and put that on. Surge. So things are a little bit different in Chrono, Chrono Cross. When it comes to magic, uh, everything is actually called elements. As you can see here. Oh, totally forgot about that. Um, you can buy um, each person, depending on the level, you can use a, a certain um, element and elements are um, are broken down by your innate colors. So it's really interesting. Um, I'm really um, it's been a while since I played this game again, like I said, so it's going to be a, a relearning process on what uh, what colors go where and what we need to do for which what for what. When Hello there, Surge. Word has it that a Komodo dragon scales are quite popular among the young zones these days. You're collecting them too, huh? Want to make a silly little necklace? That's right. <laughs> oh, so Surge, you are a man of the sea. You don't call me a Komodo dragon expert for nothing. Let me give you some pointers. Lean out your ears and listen well, Surge. This is truly top secret. A super duper secret number one rocket roll trap to sucker Use the lay of the land and make a surprise attack There's always one that likes to play tag run with all your might Beware Komodo dragons are mighty cautious and run at high speeds You may face them with your wits courage and tenacity Use your lightning start and Run like the wind whip past them with all your might Actually, I guess there is no point in overtaking them Anyhow, it's all about guts, my boy. But once you catch up to one, you must fight it. Kick that little sucker's butt. Don't get your own butt kicked. <laughs> That's all I can teach you about the ways of an expert. Now go, Surge. Go for the gold and bring forth a brighter tomorrow. <laughs> Sorry. Don't be mean. See, there's the, there's the Komodo, there's the Komodo dragon right there. That, that little girl has. Is it rock? Go down here real quick and talk to the dude. Oh, ah, uh, hi, Serge. I was lost in thoughts here. You know how Kiki is growing up so quickly. Sometimes I'm just amazed how she much she resembles her mother. Yeah, I guess my wife is like that. Ooh, she's been very much like her mother since as long as I can remember. <laughs> I guess that demonstrates how life continues on through generations. It's been about 10 years since I became a fisherman. Back then, I still had aspirations, but I ended up succeeding my dad. I guess you could say that everything, everything here represents 10 years of my life. Lion sharks, sawfish, six horned narwhals, you name it. They represent all my hard work and dedication. I love my job and I'm happy with my current lifestyle and all. But lately, I get to thinking when I see Kiki about how I am, it could have been a different future. What if I chose a different path 10 years ago? Then I'd be living a completely different life than I am now. I'm not saying which one would have been better. I'm just wondering what the other path may have led me. I guess the longer you live, the more you wonder about the other you that might have been. Boy, life is sure complex. Oh, hey, Serge, you want this? Here, take it. It's an amulet I made from a lion shark tooth 10 years ago when I decided to become a fisherman. I don't need it anymore. I have my wife and Kiki watching over me. Serge receives shark tooth. Cat. Okay. Before we head to the docks to talk to Lena, we'll go right over here. Let's look at Postal. Look at that dog. Hey, Postal. Oh, hi, Sergey Poop. 
Hey, I'm a bit busy right now. Have you already met up with Lena? He thinks she has quite a peer. Oh, if that Akronbom? Sergipoo? A present? For I? How'd you know? To accept or not to accept? Ahem. Me accept your present. And me shall help you. Me will do anything you want. Me will be honored to be by your side. He will use my pretty Miracle X Power X! He will do it, Sergi Poo! Oshul has joined your party. So now I have Poshul, who is my party member. Okay, let's talk to the radius. Oh, Serge, how goes it? Would you ever like to join everyone for my lecture? Today's lecture is the fundamentals of attack and elements. Uh, don't want to do that right now, but uh, note that he had a image. Future, future uh, chip. All right, let's go talk to Lena. Actually, before we do that, or talk to the element lady here. Show me the elements. Elements. Show me your elements. Yeah. Okay. Um how much I have 300. Okay. Yeah, so before we go and talk to uh, Lena, we're gonna just gonna go ahead and... Welcome to Lizard Rock. Where we beat up people like Squidward. <laughs> So this is the combat system. It's a lot different than uh, a, lot, a lot different than what it used to be. It's uh, it's still a uh, a turn-based, uh, but uh, there is stamina. And defend the rest of that. And there's. Heavy, medium, and light attacks. Look, here's a light. And down. The sand squirt, I'm gonna go ahead and hit with that. So like I said, combat's a little bit different. It's a little bit more uh, more for forethought before continuing. And there's no traditional levels. Um, which is a lot different than it was, you know, in, uh, in, uh, Chrono Trigger. So it's a, a it's a whole different kind of beast when it comes to systems. So it's a lot different. We trapped him. We trapped him. Now let's beat him up. Beat up the Komodo pups. There we go. Go ahead and defend. As you can see up at the top left corner, it says field effect. So if we use elements, uh, we can actually make the battlefield a certain um, or certain uh, elements are more effective. Uh, as you saw, it was kind of weird. Because, I mean, we didn't use any elements because 
surge doesn't really have i don't have really many uh elements uh for a surge just yet so this one here is the chase one remember what that dude was saying we're gonna chase him then we're gonna go get those other chests because loot is king here okay so we got two little squirts and a komodo dragon pop it's kind of a poop uh round but unfortunately that's what happens um what's really cool is when you beat bosses that's when uh your elements can change it's kind of like when an actual level up happens like you can actually just just increase like your um your uh, your stats by fighting and um obviously uh when you beat a boss you get even more um the more stats increase and you get a star which uh we'll be fighting a boss here real soon please heal you and you can see we're getting fang the bones uh all those items because those things are helpful Those are so that we can uh, put in there. So that's so we can craft. So in this game, we actually can craft um, different weapons rather than um, going around and finding a new shop. I mean, shops do sell things, but you have to have the items to craft the item, which is really interesting. And there's some pretty interesting characters that use some really interesting weapons. So, like for instance, Surge. This weapon is called the Swallow. Um, it's basically kind of like a uh, an ore. Um, back in Chrono Trigger, uh, there was actually a sword called the Swallow. It's kind of a, a reference to that, which is really cool. Everyone attacks Surge and not Potion. We got an Ivory Helmet, so we can go ahead and put that onto our dog friend here. And there is a lot of characters that use the same weapons. Uh, so it just really depends on like which character you like uh, the best and what uh, innate color they are. So we got that tablet. This is a healing item, a red colored e healing item. As you can see, I'm really just trying to focus on getting some levels before. Because I want, I want to be, well, not levels, but I mean more. more stats or I and I also want all the loot here maybe we'll attack the Lena and then we'll just basically skip this whole part and come back wait I don't know what that noise was Oh, I've, oh, nut bunnies. I totally forgot that I have to go over here, go into the hole, and then there's the 
One thing about this uh, this map is it's very confusing. Okay. Like when I first played this, I didn't know this was a hole I could jump down. And I was like, man, how do I get all that stuff over there? And all that loot. And then I never figured it out. Okay. This one right here, we're gonna actually have to surprise attack that Komodo dragon. One thing that kind of irritates me is that like takes you out of uh, when you're actually trying to do stuff and it forces the turn of the uh, the, the enemy which is just like come on man Zing C Potion actually does Ooh, damn crit oh I need to equip Potion with Elements. <laughs> kind of neglected that. There. do is we want to drop that onto that chest and we'll knock it up towards us we got a silver loop which improves our hit chance which is good you can see he's running away we need to get up on that ledge there we need to leap on him yeah I hate that how it takes you out of out of combat you're like oh it's time for the beach bum to attack it's like come on man I'm just trying to punch Punch the weird fish man in the face. As you can see, sometimes your uh, stamina doesn't all the way uh, get revived, well, refilled. You sometimes have to defend, it'll allow your stamina. Not only that, but like there is like if you use an element, it will make you go into negative numbers, which then takes a lot longer for you to act. Bop me for five. How dare you bop me for five? I don't have I don't have any attack abilities yet I need to go actually go back to the uh, like for instance we go ahead and do uplift and hit that sand squirt you can see out And one thing that does suck about the uh, the elements so you once you use it in a battle it takes a while for it to be reusable so you have to sit there for a little bit <laughs> and wait for it to uh 
Sí. I forgot. It's tablet is a an element, not an item. That's one thing I guess I still to this day get next tablet. Here in a little bit. Oh damn. Okay, that was stupid. It wouldn't it wouldn't let me jump. He's like, eh, you're not gonna jump on him. Okay, here we go. Okay, I'm just staring out. I'm gonna move, and then I'm like, pop. There we go. Jumped on top. Pop, pop, pop. Okay. Oof, I missed. You missed too, Komodo Pup. I believe the color that works the best on blue is red. Which I do have Fireball plus two. Okay, so we think we're done. Oh, it's the mama dragon. Uh, I'm gonna defend just for a moment. Okay. Ow. Way to go, Postal. That's the way to do damage. Ow, seven. <laughs> I'm kind of messed. I kind of forgot to get a, uh, the white element, um, I need to get from, uh, yeah. From Lena's house. As you can see that that element had a uh, an interesting like logo on it. That means it's a special ability. Uh, like for instance, Surge has an abil will have an ability called Slash and Dash. Easy peasy. And there we go. We grind, we gained a growth level. So now my HP goes uh, up to 73. My resistance goes up by one. My magic resistance goes up by one. And HP and res. And then got some more bones and fangs. That's the one thing that I like I don't know I don't know how many times I'm gonna say it in this video but I absolutely hate the fact that it takes me out of combat Because it's like oh, it's the it's the beach bomb the beach bombs turn It's your enemy's turn to actually attack. What are you doing? Hit him. Yes Punch and potion. Dog punch. Okay. Okay, so we have honestly gotten all of the we need 
So we can go back to our new village. And I need to go into Lena's house real quick. Because there is a skill that I need in this bucket. Photon Ray. Now if I go allocate. Um, now we have a Photon Ray, which is Surge's ability. I mean, his innate color. So now I can do white damage or light damage. Okay, let's talk to Lena. You're late, Surge. Sleeping in as usual, I suppose. You promised you'd go some... Uh, go get some Komodo dragon scales from my necklace, remember? Since you were late, my mom asked me to babysit the kids. Woohoo! Sergi, Lena, look at me! Come on, you guys, you should join us. Feels really good. Unlike the rest of you, we're not here to play. Don't swim out too far now. Okay, gotcha. It sure have it easy. Remember when it was like when we're not a single care in the world? We're worried on our minds. How each day lasted an eternity filled with newness, fun, and excitement. Amen to that. But the important thing is now is our, our, not our childhood, but my Komodo scale necklace. Yes! We have to face up to reality. <laughs> because everyone knows that a necklace is important. So I want you to go to Lizard Rock and get some scales for me. I would join you, but I still have to watch the kids. It's your fault. You were late. Once you collect the Komodo Dragon Scales, I'll catch up to you on El Paso Beach. No problem. Okay. Hey. Okay. We're gonna go to El Paso Beach now. We, uh, we have everything we need. Oh, I totally forgot about something. Palace. Shellfish frame, which is really cool. You can get different frames. Which is really awesome that the fact that you can do that. I don't want to fight right now. Don't have time to fight you. Need to go see. See that El Paso Beach. I gotta get to the El Paso Beach. Later, nerds. You should I get all the. Yeah, I got all of the, uh, the loot here. That's a beach. There you are. 
Sorry, I'm late. I hope you didn't wait too long, Serge. Oshul? I didn't expect you to see here. This is where you went off to. Wee! Lemeth here. How are you doing? Oh, are you two on a date? Dolby, anything should leave you two alone. Oh, please. Don't be silly. Oh, Poshul. Probably my one of my favorite do dog characters. Well, how'd it go? Did you use dragon scales? No, I didn't. Oh, they're beautiful. We're gonna make a great necklace with these. Thank you, Serge. And you too, Poshul. Ahem. <clears throat> no problem. It's been a long time since we came here. We used to, we used to come here so often. Now here we go, reminiscing. It never changes, does it? Been rolling in and out like this since long before we were born. It's been here for an eternity, it seems. I've probably seen seen many things, heard many things. They'll probably keep rolling in and out, in and out, long after our lifetime, without a single change. Hey, Serge, remember that time we sat and talked like this back when we were kids? The gentle sea breeze and the tranquil sound of the waves. Just the two of us, talking. You still remember that day? I don't remember. I remember. Really? You do? You still haven't forgotten the promise you made that day? <laughs> that makes me happy. But aren't memories strange? Just when you think you've forgotten about something, it comes floating back into your heart? I guess it's lying there in wait, waiting for the right moment. Why, you might even remember this very moment someday. In 10, 20 years, we're all grown up and married and have kids of our own. When that time comes, I wonder what kind of adults we'll be. What kind of life will I be leading? I wonder what the one I'll make this day. We'll never forget this day. Yeah, I hope you're right. Um, Serge, there's been something I've been wanting to... Serge. Serge. What? What's wrong, Serge? Serge? Oh, good scene time. Oh, I'm the little kid, Serge. Cue that uh, music from uh, Kingdom Hearts. <laughs> oh, what's going on? And Surge is out for the camp. What are you doing there, boy? It's dangerous to sleep out here. What? You're all right, boy. What on earth are you doing lying down anyway? For a second there, I was thinking it might have been a dead body washed ashore. Oh, can't speak. Oh, where's Lena? You were the only one I, when I saw I got here. Are you a friend of Lena's? I believe she's in the village babysitting. Well, I'd best be on my way. Anyways, you're looking for Lena. You should probably stop by the village. You know, you shouldn't be playing out here, boy. I don't want anything to happen to you now. Oh. 
Oh, sure. Sergey Poo, you're finally up. Something went whoosh. And me wa was out cold, too. They woke up first. Um, we went to look around. But not a, single, not a sign of Lena anywhere. You think Lena Thorpe and uh, spontan oh, spontaneously combusted? I'm just see if it's okay. Alright. And that's where we're going to leave it today. Uh, thank you guys so much for watching. And again, if you're from... Uh, if you're watching from... Uh, my Chrono my Chrono Trigger uh, playthrough. Thank you so much for coming back. But if you're new, make sure to hit that subscribe button that uh, lets you know every time I uh, upload a new video. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye bye.